Inside ProPresenter, you can synchronize all of the settings between multiple computers. This includes your library, props, masks, templates, everything between all of these different computers. Now, there are some caveats to this, and there's some times that you want to use this and other times you don't. The one thing that can happen is this is reliant on the internet. So if your internet connection isn't stable or you don't have fast speeds or you um, could have problems and you're relying on this synchronization to happen, you could run into issues. Um, this is different than exporting your media. Exporting your media is an individual thing. You can in, uh, export individual files or playlists. Synchronization is all of ProPresenter at one time. So let's check out how this works. So we're gonna go to ProPresenter and down to preferences. And under the sync tab, you'll see all of our settings we have available. We can include all of these different things and I'm gonna include everything except media at this time. And then we can choose our source and I'm gonna choose this network drive folder. Now you would wanna choose any folder or drive that's mounted on your computer that other computers can see so that they can access these files as well. We're gonna hit open. And now we're gonna choose what we want down here. Now we have sync files down, which means that this is the secondary computer that's receiving files from the master machine, or we have sync files up, which means that this is our machine we design everything from and we're sending everything out. And then we have bi-directional sync, which means we will take and receive files back and forth. I wanna do sync files up, and I'm gonna say replace files on server. If there's something there, I want my files to take over and then we're going to hit sync files. And as you can see, it's going through and syncing all of our ProPresenter files to that network location. So now that that's done, you'll see that um, we finished up and we could sync again if we want to. What we're gonna do is we're gonna close this out and we're gonna check out what that looked like. So now in our network drive, you'll see that we have these folders that contain all of our documents, all of our templates, as well as all of our um, our CCLI template there and all of our user data like masks and props and stage display settings. So all of our settings have been synchronized and now we just need to do this on a secondary computer to get that one synchronized up. <laughs>